extensively. Can you talk about you getting swatted? Yeah, sure. Um, I came out as trans in uh, 2017, and I lost all of my followers. Nobody liked me because I thought I was an ick. And then, as a result, people like started circulating these like, oh, look at this person. They went trans for attention, which, you know, that makes no sense. If I was getting 200 viewers on average, and then now I'm getting like 15. Wow, I got, the attention was, was gotten. Holy moly. And then a bunch of neo-Nazis started like, you know, sharing my info on places like kiwi farms 8chan so forth and that resulted in me getting right, added to back. my back let's go let's okay go. where was i where was I? okay i was added mm. to some adam waffen list which is like a neo-nazi organization mm. and then they swatted me um and the swat team was like oh you gotta get on the ground and then walk backwards look i just want to there's a comment here that's dumb as okay Jacob Blake is above the law. Who does wait, not need to listen Andrea, to the law? Wait, I want you to finish your swatting story. I am, I am. Because we got to do. The SWAT team told me to get on the ground and then walk backwards. I guess I'm above the law because I didn't fall. I got on the ground and they told me to walk backwards, but I couldn't. So I'm above the law. Think before you speak, you idiot. Okay. So my mom was disabled, right? She was elderly and disabled. The cop said, we are going to shoot you if you don't get on the ground. She couldn't get on the ground. Her leg didn't work. So the cops bum rushed her, knocked her onto the ground and like broke her shoulders trying to like put her in handcuffs for no reason, by the way. Like I was just playing Spyro on on a streaming website in front of 10 viewers. Okay, so it's like, there's no reason this is happening. I followed the instructions, right? My mother was trying to follow the instructions and they still beat the out of us and we're white. Like maybe if we were black, we would be dead. Maybe I would just be like a ghost right now and not on this podcast, right? But the thing is these people have never been in this situation where they've ever had any sort of conflict like this because they don't realize there's so many videos of white people, black people, kids, people getting shot and killed because, oh, get on the ground, walk backwards. You need to walk in a straight line. Are you drunk? Like, and they just, they give you these conflicting orders for no reason. And again, oh, you're above the law. <laughs> like, like, if you want to say, like, like okay, cop, I, I don't respect you. Is that a death sentence? Is there a law somewhere? Can you point? Y'all come. Law and order. Law and order. Like, where's the law that says if you disrespect the cop, that's a death sentence? Do I see that that's law anywhere? That's fascism. That's fascism. I don't know what that law is. If you want to point to the code in the, like, U.S. Constitution or some law book that says if you, disres if you are mildly disrespectful in any way, including body language of a police officer, you immediately get sentenced to death without a jury is that a law i would love to see that law where's that order thank you very much I uh,